What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brilliant Diamond Walkthrough. Yes, guys, another episode right here on our birthday marathon. You know the birthday marathon weekend for good old Draven right here. Age 32, the whole shebang. Yes, guys. Now, first things first, guys. The last episode kind of showed me something, and I kind of need to take care of it right here. I watched a few of my episodes, and I did say, yeah, there's not going to be a lot of Pokemon that are going to be sticking with us and all that stuff. So, yeah, change is needed right here, guys. So, the next Pokemon I need to change is Pennywise. Now, the reason being because, well, Pennywise, going into the next few battles, it's going to get demolished. Especially for a Ghost-type Pokemon. Now, the only reason why I got Pennywise was because, hey, let's try Pennywise. Or let's try, you know, Drip Bloom and all that crud. Now it's time for me to actually exchange it for a Pokemon that I know is reliable and can actually add a little more depth to my team. And that is why I am bringing in Gaia. Gaia the female, not Gaia the male, because we already got ourselves a fighting type Pokemon. So, there we go guys. Gaia is back on the team now. I knew there was a reason why I wasn't using these rare candies. And there it is guys, because we got seven of those little suckers. Let's go right ahead and give Gaia a nice evolution so BAM level 35 and just like that guys we are evolving our Gaia that way it can catch up to our Pokemon so again the reason why I'm going with Gaia you know our good old Gaia right here is because it has always been reliable with me when it came to any other game right here now this is a remake game and at this point, I kind of want to complete it, kind of want to get things, kind of want to be kind of comfortable with all that stuff. So let's go right ahead and give it another rare candy. And bam, level 36. And well, just like that, we have another evolution. Now, when will we be able to get more rare candies? I do not know. But as of right now, we're just going <laughs> to, we're just going to, uh, we're just going to be, yeah, we're just going to have to make put with this and all that stuff right here. And as you can see, guys, we got Guard Devourer back on our team. And it is learning Dazzling Gleam, a very powerful fairy-type Pokemon move. And, well, let's go ahead and take away its Heal Pulse. And just like that, guys, Gaia is adding a little bit more depth to our team right here. And, well, we got five rare candies. Don't want to use them all up. So, yeah, we're going to work, we're gonna have to work our way up to, to getting to level 40 and all that stuff since now... You know we've been doing a little bit, a little bit of work, uh, a little bit more work here. So let's see, what kind of, what kind of item should I use? Well, not really anything. Um, yeah. Okay. So that is pretty much it right there, guys. Let us move on and see what is going on in the acuity, uh, in the Acu lake acuity and all that stuff. So here we go. And as many of you guys already know, Barry's in that location. He is being the hero, and he thinks he's going to be champ or something. I don't even know. So let's go with the super uh, super repel, and let us go straight to Barry and see what happens. See if he actually succeeded or anything like that. I don't even know. So here it is. Uh, what's going on? The Pokemon of the three lakes appear to be connected somehow. When Lake Valor was blown up, a cavern appeared in the middle of the lake. And then we go right here. You're here to see the lake Pokemon too. You must be bored to fight your way through the snow to get here. Not really. Not really, it's just, I just had a Pokemon battle, gym battle, and, ah! You're not getting away with this, Team Galactic? Oh, are you finished already? Your Pokemon aren't bad, but you're laughably weak. <laughs> That's what you get, fake Ace Ventura. You honestly thought you could save the Pokemon of the lake? and become the Pokemon League Champion? Dream on, little kid! <laughs> but, ooh, it's so cold in here. Let's get back to the Veilstone HQ. And she is my hero, I'll, I'll tell you that. Oh, don't I know you? We man to turn a city. Listen, Team Galactic is going to do something huge for everyone's sake. That's why you should keep out of Team Galactic's way. Don't come whining about poor Pokemon and other trivial junk like that. Don't waste your time coming over to our HQ in Veilstone. Now, if you excuse me... <laughs> oh, man. This is probably one of my favorite parts of the game. <laughs> oh, I'm flipping you off, Barry. I am flipping you off. That's what you get. 
Yeah, that's right. I can do anything against Team Galactic. <laughs> that Pokemon called Uxi. It was suffering. I'm going to get tougher. No, you're not. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. It's not about winning or losing. That's good and that's not good enough. I have to be stronger. <laughs> oh man, I am so evil. Okay. Whew, that was funny. That was awesome. That was great. Oh my god, Barry. You are the laughing joke of Sinnoh. Okay, so let's go right ahead and see what this is all about. Um, I, I'm assuming they already got uh, Uxie right around here. As you can see, there's no Pokemon. And yeah, we, we... Let's see, what does the mission say? Head to the Team Galactic HQ. Okay, so that that is good and all. Now, before we do any of that stuff... Let's see, we got, we got Gaia back on the team right here. This is going to be interesting. Okay, so we got quite a few TMs, HMs, and all that stuff. Um, let's go right ahead and beef up our team just a tad bit because, uh, well, you know, good old Draven needs to start dominating everybody right here. So here we have Calm Mine. Guy already knows it. Um, Toxic. Rosemont already knows it. Hail, we don't need it. Uh, Bullet Seed. Okay, so let's see. So work up. Taunt. Uh, Ice Beam is a very good move. Already know it. Light screen can be used. Let's see. For a later day. And, uh, well, let's see. Hmm. Solar Beam. Thunderbolt can be a good move. Uh, low sweep. Psychic attack. And uh, Kid Thunder can actually learn that. And then we got Shadow Ball. You know what? I might just teach Gaia Shadow Ball since it is, since it is a special attack right here. Uh, double Team. Shockwave is another good move. Flamethrower. I think oh, somebody already knows Flamethrower right here. Aerial Ace. Hmm. You could give Toothless Aerial Ace for the time being. It's a very, very good move. You know what? We'll just we'll just uh, like we'll just figure that out a little bit later. What we need to do now is I don't know why I did that. Let's go let's go straight to the HQ. So we have to go back where the flag is at, right here. Not there, but right here. And there we go. Okay, again, I am laughing at Barry 100% because he totally deserved what he got. Okay, so here we are back at Veilstone, and the well, yeah, the repel has worn off, and now we have to go to the HQ and see what it, what this is going like. What's going on right here? Alrighty, let's see. Uh, welcome to Team Galactic Headquarters. Oh, I'm sorry, Team Galactic. Okay, Veilstone, Cosmic. Uh, okay, Boundless Energy. Yeah, we kind of don't need to be here right now. I think we need to go into the... Hold on. We need to go somewhere else. Hold on. Hold the phone, guys. It's been a while. And yes, I've been recording for like about a good... Quite a few hours right here. All in the name of uh, doing our... Oh, hold on. Just a sec. I just realized something. Ha! We got Rock Climb. We can actually use it now. Hold on. Alright, what is this thing right here? Let's see. We grab this. And we're going up. And what do we have here? Oh, look at that. A full incense, which can actually be used to actually breed for a, a, a munch last, I believe. So let's go right back down right here. And run. And I love the way how we glow in the dark and all that stuff. So let's see. What do we got? Galactic Warehouse. Um, here we go. And... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold it right there. Do you have a key? I don't know if you uh, if you do or not, but the storage key is safe with our guard in front of HQ. Huh? That's not what it is about? Okay. So it's with the... Yeah, okay. So we have to go all the way back. Uh, let's go back right here. All right, let's go fast because we kind of need to... Kind of need to get to the HQ and all that stuff right here. So there's a guard. Okay, get off the bike. Nope, that's the wrong thing. Let's go right here. And let's talk to this guy. There, would you look at these antennae? I don't know what they do, but those are some mighty impressive antenna. Hmm. Hey, it's you! I bet you don't remember me, but I sure remember you. Because of you, they took away my Clefairy away. Or they took my Clefairy away. My, par my partner called it quits, went back to his hometown. I don't know anything about any storage key. Huh. And he just leaves a uh, Pokeball right there. 
And look at that, guys. We found ourselves a storage key. So now it is time for us to get going. Alrighty, okay. Hey, guys, you remember, uh, you guys remember how Barry got beat by uh, Ju Jupiter? <laughs> you suck it, Barry. Okay, so let's see. Go in here. Yes, we're going to open it, and bam. And it is open. Alrighty, so let's see what this is all about. And we found ourselves a dust uh, dust stone, which can have, we can actually use to evolve a certain specific Pokemon. And, well, here we are in the uh, HQ. And, uh, well, now that we're here, let's go right ahead and start using Guy. okay? We need to actually grow its levels and all that crud. So, time to be a little more reliable. Let's go. Let's do this. Uh, haven't got a promotion yet. Okay. Let's see. You can't go through this one because there's a special key needed, and I believe it's right in there. Okay. So, let's move on and take on every trainer right here. As you can see, well, what do we have here? A trainer who's lost their way. Not really. I haven't never lost my way. And just like that, guys, we're taking on Team Galactic Grunt right here. And this guy right here is going to be coming out with a gold bat, so yes, perfect. Perfect, okay. Gaia, welcome to the party, and uh, get ready to just start destroying everything in sight. So let's go with a psychic attack. And look at this, psychic for the win. And gold bat, no more. Alrighty. Okay, alrighty, alrighty. So, let's see. What else do I have to talk about, guys? I mean, I've been recording for the last few hours right here, just for this. And, well, 10 episodes. is It's looking like 10 episodes right here. So, let's see. Let's grab this item right here before we start talking. A bottle of zinc. Okay. So, we're... I want to say we're close to being done with this game right here, okay? I am going to be doing the extra stuff. It, it's going to be fun. Uh, like, I, like I said, it's going to be challenging just playing this game. Um, but I do have a lot of free time in July, so just, you know, stay put, you know, just stay patient and all that stuff. Don't know how many episodes we're going to be coming out in July, but there's, you know, there's going to, we're definitely going to be finishing this thing up right here. So, can't wait to see what happens right here, especially when we take on, uh, take on our, our, our girlfriend. And look at that, Dust Talks has been defeated. And, well... We just keep on earning, 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 and, well, they're going to be coming out with a Bronzong, or Bronzor, and, well, let's go straight for an Infernomon right here. Alrighty, okay. So, Infernomon, let's get it going. And, well, it's coming out with a Bronzor, and level 35 right here, so let's see what we got. Let's go straight for a Flamethrower attack, and just like that, Flamethrower does its trick. Yeah, buddy. Okay. And, well, Bronzor is not happy right now. <laughs> okay. And just like that, we defeated another Team uh, team Galactic Grunt. And, well, let's go right ahead and try and get some more some more items right here. Three items. We got a Dust Stone, and I'm a Team Galactic member, but I don't even have a Pokemon. I'm the Gruntiest of the Grunts. It's my fault, though. I still don't know how the warp panels connect. Uh, great. Warp panels, which... We already know it's our best friend right here. And just like that, we're going to be finding another Pokemon trainer. Okay. Let's go right ahead and take on this trainer. And she, yeah, she she just looks like she's uh, she's coming out with a Glamia. So I think fairy types are strong against dark types. Still don't know. Well, kind of do know. It's just I tend to forget a lot again, guys. And, well, let's go straight for a Dazzling Gleam. A Dazzling Gleam, I should say. And there we go, Glammeow defeated. Okay, alrighty, and just like that, another another victory for us right there. So thankfully, they only had one Pokemon. So let's see, let's go left. Yeah, you definitely have to love these panels, and where are we? Okay, so this will actually take us right here. And... Alrighty, okay, so just be aware that there's going to be some rare items right here, guys. And here we have, I'm like close to getting my promotion to commander. I'll impress everybody, okay. But seriously, who wants to be a commander in a criminal syndicate? I just want to know that. And well, here we have Wormpole coming out. 
Holy crud. Wormple. Seriously? Okay, so how are you going to get a promotion to Commander if... Yeah, if you only got a Wormple. I just want to know that. Hmm. And there we go. Psychic Attack does its trick. And, well, let's see. More experience points for all our Pokemon. He's going to be coming out with a Dustox. So let's go right ahead and continue the Onslaught right here. Let's go right ahead. Psychic Attack. There we go. Again, it feels good to have Gaia back onto the team. I'm actually... I'm kind of thinking that like when I started this day, this whole walkthrough, I was kind of thinking of going back to Gaia just because, well, it's 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 comfortable. It's something that I know. Um, if I didn't choose uh, if I didn't choose Chimchar, I probably would have gone with Gaia number two as well. And well, Infernomon, let's get ready to go right here. Coming out with a Cascoon, and well, let's go straight for a Flame Wheel. Let's not waste any flamethrowers. I know, I kind of want to overkill, but... <laughs> and just like that, Cascoon has been defeated. Okay, and it, it was a critical hit. And yes, Infernomon, he would love to be praised and everything. So, there we go. There we go. And Kid Thunder is just looking like a beast right there. And, well, Team Galactic Grunt has been defeated. Okay. So what's next? All right, let's go straight up here and see what happens. Um, locked doors will open it with a special key. Now, if I was a comedy relief sort of kind of bad guy, I'd tell you where the key is, but I really don't know. Okay. And, well, there's a comedy relief person right there. People like you w just wouldn't understand why we do what we do. Okay. All right, well, it, this is the same spiel that, you know, every other criminal syndicate says to us. So... Here we have a Team Galactic Grunt wanting to battle us again, and coming out with a Stunky. And, well, let's see. Kind of, yeah, let's go with the Dazzling Gleam. And I'm about to sneeze right here. Holy crud. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So there we go. More experience points. Team Galactic Grunt has been defeated. And, well, let's just move on right here. Let's go right here. And I kind of want to read the sign right there. Okay, Credo. Everything belongs to Team Galactic. The beyond, or look beyond the world, space will become Team Galactic. Okay, so everything will be Team Galactic, which is hilarious. And, well, we can't go in here. So that special key is going to be needed right here. Okay, so I guess we have to go straight to the war panels. And, well, let's go all the way back down. I think you can actually find the Master Ball in here. Could be wrong. It has been a while since I've played this game. And, well, let's see. I think we go downstairs. And right here we will be finding a scientist. And, yeah, state-of-the-art facility. Not, it's, not no, or it's not no kid like you ought to keep your dirty hands to yourself. Which is kind of messed up, man. Seriously, I'm not a snot-nosed kid. Stop calling me names. Okay, so here we have Frederick, and he will be coming out with a Kadabra. Now, this is probably a good a, a good time to actually use or to actually teach a Shadow Ball, but I didn't do that, so let's go straight for a Dazzling Gleam. And here we go. And just like that, it hits Kadabra pretty good. And here comes some Reflect, of course, because you know, Kadabra's not a really physical Pokemon right here. And... Boom! Just like that, we have defeated another Kadabra, and, well, look at that, more Pokemon growing levels right there, and Infernomon to level 51, and he's going to be coming out with another Kadabra, so let's go straight for good old Hydra right here. Alrighty, let's get it, let's go, Hydra, looking like a beast, it is a beast, and, well, Kadabra, looking like a dab right there get ready to all right get ready to get beat right here so hold on just a sec let's get this crunch attack right here and bam Kadabra has been defeated okay how many Pokemon generators are in here I want to know that and well Frederick has been defeated this guy is not that strong but not that bright Let's see, what does he have to say? Our boss is trying to create an entire, entirely new world 
A world only for us, Team Galactic. It's kind of odd. And let's take that off. And here we are at the very end. And well, let's see. I don't want to battle her yet, or him. And here we have the TM36 Sludge Bomb, a very powerful uh, poison type move. And bam, we found ourselves the Galactic Key, which will help us in a. Well, this will serve as a shortcut right here. So bam. Shortcut right there. And we can actually move out of this way. Don't. Yeah, definitely don't want to battle that person right now. And. Well, let's see. Got a Galactic Key. So now we have to go retrace our steps. And go back up here. And. Let's see. Can't be going down there, but going up here. Actually, first is first. I, I, I little my, my curiosity is uh, kicking me again. Okay, so we never got, we never went through this, or actually we have. Yeah, we actually have been through that. Okay, so we have to go right here. Never mind. And let's go up here. Up here, and we're gonna go right down here. And hopefully we don't have to battle anybody right now. I think we have to. Or we already did. Okay, so use the key for this area. And bam, we're opening this place. And we're going to be finding another item right here. And that right there is the TM21 Dazzling Gleam. And, well, let's see. We're going to go down. And so I'm assuming that... Oh, crap baskets. Ha! <laughs> yeah, an intruder. You let me pass by like four times, man. Seriously. Okay, so here we are taking on a Team Galactic Grunt, and he'll be coming out with a Bronzor. You know what's criminal? Their haircuts. I just, I, I, I'm just saying. Okay, so let's see. Bronzong. Yeah, Bronzor, not... Yeah, it's uh, going to be super effective against us. So let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Alrighty, okay. So here we go. Infernomon. And yes, we're gonna be taking an extra sensory right here. Not well, it's super effective, but we are strong, strong like glorified cow ox. And well, here we go. Flame wheel nearly beats this guy. Holy crud! Okay. And well, look at that. Okay, so it is burned, and here comes the confuse ray. Okay, so I should have just gone straight for a flamethrower instead of just going for like a. You know, instead of just going for a mercy, a mercy rule or anything like that, but there's a burn, and well, let's go right ahead and come on, come on, let's go, Inferno Mon, Flame Wheel, and there you go. Alrighty, okay, alrighty. So there goes Bronzor, and what is next? Who's next? And he's coming out with a Stunky. So let's see. Hold on just a sec. Uh, yes, let's go straight for a Toothless. And, well, Toothless ready to go right here. And we're still trying to get this guy to evolve. I believe at level 49, 48, 49, it's supposed to evolve. So, yeah. So here we go, Bulldoze attack. And, bam, Stunky has been eliminated. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, all righty. Toothless ready to go, kick it some butt, take it some names, Team Galactic Grunt, just realizing that, yeah, you suck. Okay, let us move on right here, and, well, let's see. Okay, so we have to retrace our steps, and I believe we have to go towards another another uh, war panel right here, so let's go straight down right here, and go straight back into this war panel. And, well, let's see. We have to go back over there. I think, let's see. I think they took the left side. Yes, okay. So now we have to go to the right side right here. And what do we find? We find ourselves a Poke... Or, a, yeah, we find ourselves TM49 Scald. Another good move. And, well, let's see. I think we have to go... I think we have to go into the HQ now. Could be wrong. Yeah, okay, so I think we have to go to the HQ now to, let's see, to see what happens right here. Okay, so, already out, and yeah, we we are already out of here, so, let's see, I think we have to go, yeah, to the other building, so, alright, we've already completed this portion right here, 
I guess we can we can stop right here and then go on to the next episode, uh, finishing off the whole uh, the Veilstone the Veilstone stuff and whatnot or anything like that. So, okay, yeah, I just need to find the Pokemon Center. And that's it. Uh, crap baskets. Okay, you know what? Let's go with the bike. Huh. Okay, come on, find the Pokemon Center, which is right here somewhere. I guess I don't know. No, nope, not right there. That's the dress up. Okay, so in the next episode, guys, we're going to be going into the HQ, the Team Galactic HQ and all that crud. And we're going to we're gonna be finishing it off right there. Not necessarily finishing it off, but just uh, the, the big portion of it right there. Getting to figure out what Cyrus is all about and all that crud. So thank you guys again for watching. Stay tuned. One more episode on day one of our little marathon right here. Thank you guys again for watching. Click on the subscribe button, notification button, and yeah, if you guys want to make a small donation to this channel, links on the description right there below. I will see you guys next time.